every day with the latest news from Chelsea and in order to not miss anything, don't forget to turn on the notification bell. Barcelona coach Xavi Hernandez has a preferred midfield trio of Pedri, Ilkay Gundogan and Frankie de Jong who he considers his main team. The coach intends to place Oriol Romeu as a defensive midfielder in specific game situations. Thus, Chelsea and Paris Saint-Germain are exploring the opportunity to sign Gavi, taking advantage of this situation. In the opening game of the season against Hetafe, Gavi was among the substitutes. He made a brief appearance as a substitute, indicating his limited playing time. This restricted involvement could be due to an injury sustained during preseason preparations. However, it's worth mentioning that the young midfielder has recently signed a new contract until 2026 this summer, potentially complicating any transfer attempts. Reportedly, the new contract includes a substantial release clause, which could prompt PSG and Chelsea to reassess their positions. The 19-year-old left Barcelona's La Mesa Academy two years ago, showing off his technical prowess. Gavi established himself as a regular in the first team over the course of the previous season, racking up an impressive 97 caps for Barcelona's senior side. His contributions include 5 goals and 13 assists. Having made his debut for Spain in 2021, the youngster has earned 21 international caps and scored 3 goals. Renowned for his outstanding performances, the Spaniard won the Golden Boy Award last year, solidifying his reputation as one of the sport's most promising talents. Despite the interest from Chelsea and PSG, it is very likely that Gavi will remain at Barcelona beyond the current summer transfer window. However, this situation could evolve if he continues to face challenges to secure significant playing time. And now Chelsea fan I want to know about you. What is your opinion about this? Put your opinion in the comments, I don't know if you know, but your opinion is very important for Chelsea at any time I'll be back with another news from Chelsea.